Is your Windows PC crashing or do you get errors trying to run apps? This may be the result of corrupt or missing system files. This video will show you the steps to repair your Windows installation using the Deployment Image Servicing and Management Command Tool and it works for Windows 10 and Windows 11. The Deployment Image Servicing and Management, or DISM, tool is a command line utility that you can use to replace corrupt files in your Windows installation image. You can run it by going to the Start menu, type in CMD, and run that as Administrator. At the command prompt, type in the following command, DISM, and make sure to use spaces between each one of these switches. Then use the three switches, slash online, slash cleanup dash image, and slash restore health. Hit enter and it will run through looking for corrupt files and automatically repair them if it finds any. Now this process may take a few minutes or it could take several hours depending on what it finds and how long it takes to restore all of those corrupt images. This operation should complete successfully. If you get any errors like an error 87 it may just be because you didn't use spaces in this command line or you might have pending installs in your Windows Update. So go to Start, Settings, Windows Update, and make sure you don't have anything pending here. Check for updates and do the installation and then run that utility again. Obviously, you'll need to be able to get to the command prompt in order to run this utility. And if your PC is so messed up you can't even get to this point, make sure to check out my 10 advanced Windows 10 tips and tricks video for more ideas on how you can resolve those problems. I'll put a link in the description of this video. It's a good idea to follow up the DISM tool with the System File Checker utility. This will fix any errors in your operating system from your newly repaired System File Source Cache. To run that, type in SFC space forward slash scan now and hit enter. This tool can take several minutes to run as well, and in this case you'll see it didn't find any integrity violations, but if it did, it'll automatically fix those as well. That's a quick fix to some common Windows crash issues caused by corrupt files. Check out my Windows 10 maintenance task video for other recommendations to keep your Windows system running smooth. Link provided in the description of this video. Hey, if you want to see more videos like this one, please subscribe. And if you've enjoyed this video, be sure to click the thumbs up and leave a comment. I really do appreciate your support.